this is Brian, and welcome back to this commentary playthrough of Breath of Fire 2. So, yes, Rand is actually the lowest level character now. I don't remember if this is exactly even the party that I ended up with, but this is who I am going to use now going forward for a little bit at least. And I did... Um, I wanted to come back here just because this is where I left off, so I figured we'd pick up from here. On Monster Island, I guess, or whatever you call it. I did put the Unity back on Spar, and I did put uh, the Fire one. What was it? Sansa? Sasa? Yeah. Whichever one that is, the Shaman's on Rand. I had enough money to upgrade everything that I wanted, and one of the enemies actually dropped this shiny bracelet. And that actually... acts like a ribbon. So it protects you from all status ailments. At least as far as I can tell, that's kind of what it said it does, so... Here's what I got for Rand. Hat. I put the D-airing that Ryu had on her. And Spar. I didn't end up upgrading equipment for Blue yet, just because she's still above level 32, so... I never brought her into the party for my upgrading. Um, spells, we got a few more, not for him. He learned Heal, Renew, and 8.0. I don't remember if I had that or not. So. No new spells for Cat. Um, I think Shield and Defense Up X are the new ones here. But I think we had Freeze already. Bow I kept with me because his shot ability was basically imperative in killing a lot of these guys. Just because I didn't I didn't get to show it off, I don't think, in the few battles that I fought on screen, but his shot ability didn't hit all the time. But I'd say maybe about 25% of the time it had a chance of just basically instantly killing those enemies, because it would hit for like as much as their max HP was. That helped out quite a bit. Also, a few of those enemies dropped extracts and van extracts. So I got quite a few of those items here. Oh yeah, I even got another one there. That I picked it up after I had done the last cleanup. So the only problem with those is that they do not stack. So if I get in a position where I feel like it's wasting too much inventory space, I might put some of them in the bank. Well, let's go back to Farmtown. And the last thing we did was pray for a good harvest, so... Go back. No. Let me save it at the dragon statue here, just in case anything happens. Also, in my time on the island there, I only ever got wiped out once. That's because there are all the big enemies you could find there. But there are also... There's one group of enemies called... There's some of those sludges, like an orangish colored one. I think they're K-sludge. I can't remember what the initial was, but... They actually come in groups of three, potentially. And if you get a group of three of them, they have really high defense and really high HP. And they hit you for like a hundred... HP a turn, and if you got three of them, well, there's 300 HP every round that you're losing. So I did get wiped out by one of those groups. I also did manage to kill off a group of just two of them, because sometimes they showed up in groups of two. And when I did kill the group of two of them, they, they gave me 60,000 experience and 10,000 gold for killing two of them. So, definitely pretty nice if you can handle them. Okay, yeah, this guy's back now. Let's see if we can find Daisy first, though, and talk to her. Okay, well. Doesn't seem to be in the house. I guess let's talk to that guy. Did they do something to her? Ah, Rand. This is a letter from Daisy. I'm having Eva Church built here. I am going to the Grand Church. May the light of St. Eva be with you. It is no doubt Daisy's handwriting. What? 
Daisy understands now how wonderful the Eva Church is. That's why we are building the church here. Smells fishy. No way! There's no way that my mother would believe in a religion like yours. What have you done to her? What do you mean a religion like yours? And... <laughs> Please, stop accusing us. Daisy became a believer of St. Eva. That's all. Or do you have proof that we did something? You... Son of a... Okay, I guess it's one-on-one -on -one here, so... Does it really... Well, I guess I can see if this... How much this does. I've had that used against me, but I haven't used it in a battle. Okay, well that was a hundred. What's my... The stack. Okay, I don't think so. Yeah, physical and 8.0 is going to be about the same, it looks like. And Rand has pretty powerful healing spells, too, if I do get to the point where I feel like I need it. He's got high HP, though, so... Take quite a few rounds for him to get pretty low. Okay, we got it. Oh, Father Ray! These people are being difficult. What? You're the ones taking over someone else's land? I've been told that Daisy donated this land after identifying with the teachings of St. Eva. That's right! And this man is mistaken. Mistaken? You have a lot of nerve. Stop it. I have a responsibility to protect the believers of our church. If you continue to act this way, you'll have to deal with me. Interesting. You're just another servant to a dumb god. Saint Eva is not a dumb god. Someday you will also understand. Well, I don't understand. I don't want to understand. Now, get off of my mother's land. I don't intend to continue with this misunderstanding. However, someday we will understand each other. Yes, I don't know. Ray doesn't seem to be a bad guy, but he is following St. Eva, and they seem to be the bad guys. Something doesn't seem right. You guys know my mother isn't the type of person to change her mind just like that, right? You think the Eva church people took her by force? Yes. You agree? Gotta check them out. And their headquarters. And about St. Eva Church, I guess is what that's supposed to be. St. Evach? I think St. Eva Church is the problem. Churches in the other towns are being deceived. Don't you think so? Maybe. But I haven't thought about how to get there. Now, what can we do? If we could fly, it would be easy. Okay, so... We've already unlocked, or at least done part of what we were supposed to to kind of lead us to the next area. And as far as that goes... I think going to Guns was supposed to be like a next step, because... There was a tree there that would guide us to Echichi, I think was her name. And once we found her, she'd talk about, and she'd go back to home, our township. And then when you talk to her there, she talks about flying and Windia. So that points us to Windia as our next destination because we want to fly. Oh, 
However, that would also mean that Rand has basically served his purpose for now. So I guess I will leave him a little behind because he didn't quite get enough to get up to level 32. Yes, he bows at 41. He's actually ahead of Ryu. And the rest are 32. But if we're going to Windia, we're going to want Nina. And I'll just show her stuff off quickly since I got her in the party. So, yeah. I don't think I changed much for her armor. I might have picked this stuff up for her. Spells, she did get a few. I think she had Typhoon before and maybe Freeze. And I might have even had Angel. Holy Power All. But I mean, I know Death is a new one. It's, I don't know what the chances are of it actually landing though. I think it's fairly small, so that's probably not something I'm going to use too much. And I did pick up Ice Fang at like level 31, so I haven't tried that out yet. But that'll probably be a pretty good one. It does cost 17 though, but she has close to 200 for AP by now. This is the time where you can go back to Namanda if you want. Because you can try and get that optional... You can basically get, try to play the musical instrument with those two guys. I'm not going to do anything with that. Because, well, I know I'm not that good at it. So that's the spell that I'm not going to pick up. But just to let you know, it's there and it's available if you want to try a side... Or like um, any game type of thing. So I think at this point we're basically just ready to go to Windia. And. Since we're dealing with Nina's people, I suppose let's put her in the lead. I don't know if she needs to be necessarily to progress, but might as well. Let's make this our save point for now. Although with my characters leveled up as they are, I wouldn't imagine I'm going to get close to getting wiped out for a little while. I'm sorry, but no one is allowed in the castle at this time. You please tell the king that Nina has returned? Nina? Sounds familiar. There is something I must ask the king. Please, allow me to see him. Nina? Who are you? Let her through. Oh. It's the queen. My queen, but... Oh, and her name's Hina. Hina, Mina, and Nina, huh? You can let her through. I'm in. There is a legend about the Black Wing in Windia. It is said when a child with black wings is born into a royal family, there will be trouble in the country. In order to protect the country, a child with black wings must be killed. This is the law. But, there is no way we could do that. Nina, I kill you? Oh yeah, pretty dark. I told everyone that you died. Then we took you to the magic school in hometown. The reason why we forbade you to come back to the castle is because I want to protect you from those who knew the legend. However, now, the king has fallen sick. He wants very much to see you, Nina. Not only the king, I too. Mother, Nina, you have grown into a beautiful woman. Go now, Nina. King, your father is waiting. Yes, mother. I think it would probably be up the stairs, basically. 
But this is the first time we actually have cats or access to the castle at Windia here, so. Explore around a little bit and see if there's anybody else to talk to or any treasure. Okay, well. There's a gate there. Long ago, the people of Windia had bigger wings, and they could change them to a bird whenever they wanted. Yeah, so they could in Breath of Fire 1, but I guess they've lost that ability as they evolved. I hope the king is okay. The black wing is spooky. Isn't it a sign that something bad is going to happen? Yeah, I mean, but what is Nina? She's got to be around 17 or... 16, 17, 18, somewhere in that range, and she's been alive this whole time. Nothing bad's happened yet, has it? Oh, by the way, where's Mina? Those stairs lead to the Eastland. Yeah, and if you remember earlier in the game, that's where we came out from the dungeon below, so we've explored all of that. Bet it would feel great to fly. Maybe I'll need to diet to be able to fly. <laughs> Saying she's a little fat, maybe? I think got another Tolan. Even if I had to remain a bird for the rest of my life, I'd still want to be able to be a bird. Hmm. Do I want to go through this door or up the stairs first? Okay, well, this is just a tease, I guess, to show me that there's a treasure above the stairs down there. Or you're going to have to come up from downstairs, I guess, to get to it. If the king dies, what will happen? Mina is still so young. But I mean, wouldn't the queen take over then? Because if it's to do with something about, like, not having a female ruler, well, I mean, Nina's his daughter, so I would think the queen would take over at least until she came of age then or something. I don't know. Okay, this seems to be going way, way up. What is this? Everything is fine. It's nice and shiny because it's magic energy. There are no problems. Sound like you're trying to convince somebody. And it's got kind of the dungeon type of music there. Well, I guess... Maybe we'll have to come back to that at some point, so let's remember that that's there. This is one of the guys that you could invite to your party, or to your home township, but we're already full, so it doesn't give you the option anymore. And I think that's just the other side of those bars that we saw before in that one place on the left-hand side. Okay, yeah, and this just basically wraps around there. So. One more room to explore before I go upstairs. Okay. You're not allowed in the basement. Unless you have something really important. What does that mean? From here, it is the ceremonial tower. It can only be used for special ceremonies. Okay, another... A lot of blocked off areas still here. What's the middle part? It's like the throne room. Exactly. This is the king's room. Must not wait here without a reason. Curtains are blowing. What's this old guy doing? King is resting in his room. 
thought they said this is his room. I suppose this just means the throne room and his room by the old by that the old guy means his bedroom. Okay, this is somebody's bedroom. Or barracks kinda maybe. Guest room, I don't know. I think this is the other side of one of the areas I already saw. Uh, it's kind of easy to get turned around. And okay, that's the king's room, but it looks like the other staircase over here must lead somewhere else then. So let's check that out first. The queen's not been getting enough rest. He must be very concerned about the king. This must be the queen's room. Bum's cloak. Been a while since we've been using one of those. So that'll sell for like what? Ten coins maybe? Oh drop. Okay, that's better. Pray to St. Eva to heal the king. Or St. Eva's people. Oh, your majesty. Got a pretty big bed. Father. That voice. Is it Nina? Yes, Father. It's Nina. Oh, Nina. You still call me Father? After what I've done? Flashback, I guess. King, make a definite decision. And not let this child live. Um, um. What are you going to do with me? You must give her up. Fate is fate. Child with black wings. How could this be? Darling? No, King. Please, I beg for mercy. King, a child with black wings will cause misfortune. You must not forget this legend. This is all for the good of Windia. What am I to do? Ah, uh, ne- Father! There's- I don't know why they waited this long, or maybe they don't have the wings right away when they're born. Father! Look, Father! I have wings! Okay, yeah, I guess that explains it. Must be like an adolescence type of thing, maybe? Uh... What is it, Father? Why do you make such a face, Father? Father? I could not protect you. I sent you to hometown so you wouldn't be killed. I'm a terrible father. You must hate me. I mean, in a way, you sent her there to protect her, I suppose. No, father. I don't hate you. It was hard to say goodbye to you and mother. But I now have these wonderful friends. Oh, Nina. <coughs> Oh, your majesty. King, now is the time to spread the teachings of Saint Eva. It is time for everyone to pray for the king. Uh, um... Your majesty, if we spread the teachings of Saint Eva, you will get better. Doubtful. I still cannot agree with that. Why? Do you think the teachings of St. Eva are wrong? No. The of St. Eva are wonderful. However, it's... Isn't it wrong for me, the king, to push those beliefs on others? 
Depends what kind of country you're living in. I thank you for your thoughtfulness, messenger, but I don't intend to make the teachings of St. Eva the teachings of this country. O oh, King of Windia, you will regret this. The teachings of St. Eva are spreading throughout the world. You have nothing to gain by turning us into your enemies. I don't need any prayers. After all, this wonderful daughter of mine has come to see me. Thank you, Nina. Uh, uh. Gramps, have a request. Please open the door to the basement. What? You don't intend to use the powers of that? Because the rest of our group are like, what are you talking about? If you use those powers, you would never return to being a human. I, I won't allow it. Gramps, please understand. In order to save father, no, the world. I need that power. It's hard for an old man like me to understand anything complicated. But I'll believe in you, Nina. I'll have them open the door. Thank you, Gramps. In the basement of this castle, the powers of the Great Bird are sealed. If I become the Great Bird, I can carry everyone to St. Eva Church. Let's go, everyone. Well, I knew Nina when she was a little girl. Once she puts her mind to it, We'll carry it through. The brave girl. Yeah, so I guess that sounds like we're gonna lose Nina. So that part kind of sucks. Gonna make our way back to the basement. I think it was the far right one over here. We have anything different? I never thought that Nina would ever bring misfortune to this country. Only those who believed in foolish legends could hate her. It's already down. What is going on which allows you to go into the basement? It's the end of the world as we know it, dude. Alright, so... And we got a dungeon again, basically. There are a couple of treasures down here, but there's not too much. And I'm pretty sure there were going to be random encounters. Yeah. But also, if I didn't point it out... Yeah, even after my re-equipping everybody, I have 86,000 coins left, so yeah, we got quite a bit saved up for now. And we have some new guys, but for this point it should be pretty easy for a little while. So yeah, gargoyles, let's see how easy they are. Ryu especially should attack fairly hard. Although, I guess they seem like they have fairly high physical defense. Okay. That's pretty good on experience. Okay, we can go farther down into the basement there. I think I'm going to check this route first. Okay, that's the Barracuda, so we've seen these guys. So far, so good. Now can Ryu finish? Oh yeah, especially with the special. Might have to backtrack and go down that other staircase if I feel like I missed something there. If this turns out to be the right way forward.
Okay, well, we're going down in the basement either way. I am going to backtrack and check out the other one because I feel like it might have just been for a treasure. So, we're going to call it there for today, though, but next time when we pick up, I'll quickly head back there and we'll check that out and go forward from there. Try to see if we can turn Nina into a big bird. Great bird, I think they said. Anyway, thanks for watching, and if you've been enjoying the content so far, please like, comment, and subscribe or follow, and we'll catch you next time.